The areas of implementation are where there are high levels of extreme poverty, where deep-seated traditional and social norms exist, negatively impacting on women and girls. The strategic approaches to girls' education targets girls who are highly vulnerable and systematically marginalized due to factors such as early marriage and teen pregnancies and girls with disability between the ages of 10 and 19 years. The project provided training in two mutually supportive tracks, formal and non-formal, for 17,000 marginalized girls who were out of school in seven regions, namely Northern, Northeast, Upper East, Upper West, Central, Eastern and OT regions. The country director of work education, Susan Idu Aye, said the project has transformed lives. About 8,000 girls have been retained in formal school through their scholarship kits that we give to them, through sensitization of their families. So all this kind of support has retained these girls in school. The formal track of the project is implemented in 13 districts and 300 communities across four regions. The Development Director of the United Kingdom Foreign Commonwealth Development Office, Beth Cartman, says they funded the project to increase girls' enrollment. The program has led to significant improvement in learning for the girls that HIT has worked with. Incre Increasing numeracy by 21%, literacy by 18%, and supported successful transitions into employment.